Good morning. It is ten past eleven on Sunday, the fifth of May, and it is time for today in my bujo. How are you? Are you having a good day? I hope so. So, yesterday. I didn't put makeup on. I don't remember putting makeup on. Hmm. Did the challenges. No booze. I did have a glass of fizzy with dinner. I did not have caffeine. I did not have chips. I crafted. And then I will put the rest of the stuff in as well. And I did my hands and my face. Yay! So almost, almost a full house look. Getting better if I'd worn makeup and not had that glass of fizzy with dinner. That would have been the whole. Whole kit and caboodle. Yay! Um, I didn't do that last night, so let's quickly just fill that in. My mood was pretty good. I spent the day watching Snooky yesterday and I quite enjoyed it. I haven't watched Snooky in bloody ages. Uh, yeah, my pain was probably about the same, so... Yeah, I loves me a bit of Snooker. My nana used to watch Snooker. My nana was a firm believer in a pint of Guinness in the afternoon while watching the Snooker. And she'd have her pint of Guinness and then she'd fall asleep. And my whole family would sit there going, fucking Snooker's on. She's fallen asleep and left the fucking snooker on. And you didn't dare turn it off because, of course, the minute you did, she'd wake up. And I was watching that. <laughs> Bless her heart. And um, so the whole family had to sit there through the snooker. And I think it was doing that that made me like it. You know, because that's back in the days of bloody, um, oh, before Steve Davis, you know. Oh. Fitbit. Yesterday. I came up with a really good plan yesterday. I was catching up on some TV and I set my timer and I did 10 minutes of step in, 10 minutes of sitting down knitting, 10 minutes of step in, 10 minutes of sitting down knitting. And I got loads done, it was really good. Well, I would have got more knitting done if I'd spent longer on it. The trouble was, I'm on such a big, complicated piece that it takes me 20 minutes just to do one row. But then I'm doing like several hundred stitches, so yeah. But I racked up just under 16,000 steps, so I'm quite pleased with that. Okay, yesterday I cleaned Daryl's table, I put pet bowls in the dishwasher and turned the dishwasher on and I did the worktops and I swept the floor. You have to excuse the coughing in the background, Daryl's got yet another infection so he's fighting that off today. Okay, so I did some journaling. I also painted in Superman because I had some space and um, on Friday night my daughter and I sat and watched all three Superman, the first three Superman films, you know, the original three with the original Superman. Have a cup of tea. Um, so it just seemed, you know, that I, should, I should put that there. That's the Jane Davenport watercolours. I love how colourful, bright they are. Do you know what I mean? Really nice and bright. I love how this came out. I'm really, really pleased with that. So, yeah. And I don't know whether they look it on the camera, but to me, they're not too small. Yeah? So, I mean, with some of the other college collages that are on that app, and I'm going to have to link that down below. Hang on, let me write that down. Um, pick stitch. Um, yeah, I mean, on some of the other collages that actually use up all of the frame, you could get 10 or 11 pictures of about that size, which would be great for like holidays and shit like that. So, yeah, I'm really pleased how that came out. Oh, I love this colour. Okay, dokie. 
weather. I still haven't checked. I'm going to check the weather right now while you guys are on here. We're still at 50-50. It's 50% 50 no and 50% watercolour. Tombow pens and colouring pencils don't even have a vote. Now, one of those watercolour votes is mine. And if I um, remove that vote, that means that no is winning. So I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to ask again at the end of this month what you think. Shall we leave it blank? Or shall I maybe add what? Oh, we can do what colour next month. You know, it's no skin off my nose. I don't mind. So, yeah, that's interesting. I honestly thought you guys would go for some colour. Partly cloudy, like that. Doop, 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 doop. Oops, that went a bit scooted. My cable was under me. And I'm also trying not to go in like that and get my face in the shot. Oh my word, I lent on it and I've, I've now got a, a view of the world from space. Wow, that looks good. Uh, weather. <laughs> okay, so we've got a high of 12 again. Not very warm. I know, six, although I actually shut the, all the windows and turned the bloody heat on yesterday because it was cold. And it's cold in my house, you know? So, sun up is. 5.32 Sundown is 8.31 And I'll leave it like that Being as that, that is what you guys have voted What? Hi YouTube Hi YouTube Do you want me to come in and put another film on? Yeah Okay, I'll be right back I settled in with 101 Dimensions. The film, not literally 101 Dimensions. I would be freaking if there was 101 Dimensions in my house. <laughs> so today I have done my day face cream. Look at the colour. I love this colour. It's probably my favourite pen in this whole pack. Look at it. It is just such a gorgeous colour. Right. Um, I am going to do. So I'm just going to show you one of the other tracks of my. So let's do. This is just not the Greenwich Tarot, this is just the Witch's Tarot. So I need a colour. Seven, two, three. She a nice, strong, imposing figure, isn't she? Swords are to do with um, the mind and communication. So she's obviously a very, very strong woman. She's there, she's on her throne, she's got her sword. The beast has... Um, submitted to her if you like but look where she is she's in a very very cold climate so what this is to me is is that it's you know you can you can be strong mentally emotionally you can get your point across but don't be so cold about it that you she's there on her own don't alienate yourself through your act, learn a bit of tact, I suppose, is, is is the best way to describe that. And that is me to a T. Um, I grew up in Germany and I was taught to be very truthful, very honest about what I was at, but I wasn't taught how to be tactful. And um, I was accused of being quite rude when I was a very small child because I would just say it, you know, no, I don't like that, it makes you look fat, or <laughs> yes, your bum does look better than that, you know, <laughs> that kind of thing. Um, and um, I, I offended quite a lot of people when I was younger. Um, I, I was a teenager really before I learned any decent amount of tact and then as I sort of got to my 30s I was like well bollocks tact doesn't get you anywhere tact doesn't get you anywhere so um, say it how it is it's much easier so yeah that is what I'm getting from that okay is there a woman in your life that's like this other than me of course um, she doesn't mean to hurt your feelings 
if there is, if this is not you, and um, you know this this is maybe ringing true for somebody, um, she doesn't mean to. It's just the way she is. You know, um, and she doesn't mean to upset anybody. But that's just that's just who she is. That's how she is. Suck it up, Buttercup. Um, I put being forthright and honest is a good thing. Careful you don't come across as cold. So there you go. That's that one. Did that earlier. Sleep. From two until eight. And it wasn't a very good sleep because, like I said, Daryl was cough, 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 and he was in my bed doing it all night. So yeah, so it's just before eight o'clock that he woke me up. Cause he wakes up and he's full of the drugs. Hello, mummy. Can we get up and have breakfast now? And I'm like, so it's gonna be down there, which is real shame because this is my favourite colour, and I want to colour in loads. I should just have to do lots of steps, won't I? So that I'm colouring that side. Okay, it is Sunday. I have cleaned the loo, changed the beds and put some laundry on. I've got two and a half hours until the snooker starts. Oh, jammy jibs. Okay, I have not done a word. I've marked off that I've done a word and I haven't done one. So, I'm going to grab my pack of pens and I'm going to backtrack because that's awful that I haven't got a word. So, yesterday, and I have to look at my diary because my brain is mush and I'm awful. So, yesterday was snooker, I think. Mm, I'm going to use that for today. Okay, I think yesterday's word then will be interview for my son's job interview and it did go quite well he said so fingers crossed Friday I know that's gonna be Superman because Kylie and I sat watching Superman all night or well, half the night anyway gotta learn a bit of Superman right Thursday what happened Thursday oh I'm awful I tell you Thursday. Oh, I went out with I went out with Kelly. We had cake. So I think cake might have to be the word for Thursday. Which is better than writing Daryl was a git because he was pretty much all day. Cake. And then Wednesday. Well, we did live, didn't we, people? So, you know. Live. There you go. I am all caught up. <laughs> all caught up with that. Right, so. I have placed the order from um, Amazon that my mother wanted. I haven't done any of that yet. I'm sure there's something else I meant to mark off, but I can't for life remember what it was. No, nope, can't remember. That is, it's heavy and it is, an, is a little bit annoying. It, I think in future I will do tip-ins from the middle. So the stitching is holding up well, for those that are interested. This is the middle of the book now. So, yeah, it's held up quite well. It doesn't look like it's ripped too much. I did pull it quite tight, so it has a wee bit. So I might later just run a little bit of invisible tape down there, just to help stop it pulling that little little bit extra. Anyway, um, 
What colour did we do yesterday? I can't remember. Oh, it was Blue Moon, wasn't it? Because I made my fantastic Star Wars pun that that is not a moon. <laughs> okay, Stardust. Which can only be either that colour or the other colour. And it's that one. Because I only have two really gross, disgusting yellows like that. <laughs> and that was not me slagging it off before anybody gets guns. I used to, I mean, look at it. It's lurid, isn't it? That's just... Right, let's just move me away from the little cornery bit. So, experience with the four has told me I'm going to have to do this carefully. It's nice to hear the bikes. I hope they're having a good weekend. It's the weather's. Yeah. The weather's been cold but not awful. It's not working. And only cold at night. It's quite nice during the day. Yay, that worked. It was a bit fiddly. Mainly because the number's so small, but. I'm going to have to wash this stencil. It's been quite hard to get the bits off. I've just noticed putting it down. You can see on the two that there's still quite a lot of black there. That's the wrong way. And I can see colour on the three and the four as well. Obviously not doing a very good job at cleaning yet. I think the reason the colour is catching on it is because it's cut quite roughly. So while I like the stencil, I don't know how well it's going to hold up, you know. That's it. Uh, you can't even see that, I don't think. That's how sort of pale it is. It's not a very good colour. But it is there, honest. <laughs> I did do it, I'm not lying. Can you even see that? There you go. So yeah, here's the stitching in the Tom Away paper that I did. I'll try and get that in focus. I'm trying to do this with sort of two hands. Let's get in as far as I can. Right, I need to be that close. Okay. So yeah, there's my little knot. So there may be a little bit of tearing just where the threads are going the other way. I'm trying to do it so that you're not getting glared out, but also so I can see. Yeah, so I might just run a little bit of the invisible tape just to help hold it, if that makes sense. So, yeah. Anyway, um, that's it. I'm going to go and get on with my day. So, what do we need to do chores wise? Um, I might stick my giant paper clip just there to help hold it. Because that's quite heavy as well and it might just add to the whole sheer weight of the blast of thing. Just to stop it sliding around. Give it a bit more structure for now. Um yeah, so today chores. I've got a vacuum. I didn't vacuum downstairs, so I've got to do upstairs and downstairs. Um, I actually did clean the bath because I had a bath and then I had to clean the bath because I had a think pink lush bath bomb, which was fabulous. But my god, it made a mess. So I have cleaned the bathroom as well. Yay, me! I knew there was something else I'd done. So I think I'm going to go and run the hoover around. And the rest of it is just throughout the day stuff. Yes, I still haven't cleaned the oven. They're probably not going to get done today either. It's one of those jobs that I put off because it's... Oh, disgusting. <laughs> it is. Oh, it's a horrible job. Absolutely foul. I hate cleaning the oven. Anyway. Uh, yeah, I'm going to leave that there. And um, I've got to do the Fitbit admin stuff. I've got to sync my diaries. I've got to do some of that as well. Um, some of it's just simple stuff, it's just remembering to bloody well do it. It'd be nice to actually get to the end of a week and not carry my fucking list over. <laughs> yes, well, there we go. <laughs> but, 
you know. Anyway, have a fab day and I will see you in the evening edition. Party bye. Good evening. We had a good day. I've got wires all over the place. I'm just trying to get everything out of the way. <sighs> I've had quite a good day. I've been watching snooker and it's been really, really good. So, let's get closed down for the day. And then we can go to bed. Phone is buzzing away. Right. <sighs> the challenges are ready. I have not had booze. I did have a small bottle of this earlier. I did not have caffeine. I apologise if you can hear Daryl snoring through the baby monitor. He's all blocked up. <laughs> I have crafted. Looks like he might have given it to me as well. My throat really, really aches. Oh, I didn't write in my steps. Look, I just slightly reorganised the top of my um, cart so nothing is where it usually is, which is a bit confuddling. So 15915, which is 6.67. We didn't vacuum in the end. And gave the office a little bit of a tidy. I need to do the rest of that in a minute before I go to bed. If I can be bothered. Okay. Work week hustle and the scores were done. Amanda cancelled her live, <sighs> which means I didn't get done the things I was going to do this evening while I was watching it, because <laughs> I ended up watching the snooker and stepping and knitting instead. Um, oh, I printed this photo up of Daryl just because it showed off his really long eyelashes. mega long eyelashes and I did it as a half and half with that photo the little bit of an imperfection on that it's picked up from somewhere hmm. um, that I took when we went out the other day I'm playing with it slightly to um, I'm playing with the exposure slightly because it prints up red like it makes my face look quite pink and my face is not that pink. <laughs> so I'm playing with it and I'm trying to get it right. But not anyway. So the oh excuse me. It's because my throat aches. The prompts are sunglasses and hair crimpers. <laughs> you remember hair crimpers? Oh do you can tell I'm old, I remember hair crimpers. <laughs> that looks really pants. Oh well. That paper clip is so freaking chunky. It's amazing how much of a difference that has actually made. Can you hear Daryl? It's like super loud. Right, the words are. Do, 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 do. Oh, what's the fifth? Born to be wild. Um, and it's in black. Because we used grey yesterday. Run a bit. Run a bit bonkers at the end there. I'm gonna lose birch again. Or not. Born to be wild. 
love that song. <laughs> Headed on the highway, looking for adventure. Let's use sparkling paint. Because glasses need to be sparkly. They really, really do. Wrong brush, man. That's my that brush. Where is my wee brush? My stomach's just decided to remind me that it's not had snacks this evening. <laughs> That's deliberate because I'm trying to fucking lose weight. My stomach's there going, Oi, I'm hungry. My brain is going, Suck it up, bitch. I'm going to make my straighteners bright fucking orange. My crimpers, rather. I never had a pair of crimpers. I never crimped my hair. Just seemed like far too much effort. I did, I did buy straighteners, but not until I was an adult. But I never crimped it. I did have somebody plait it all up for me once. That was when I first started thinking about dreads. I was only a kid. And um, she plaited my hair up while it was wet. And let it dry naturally. And then I slept with all these little platties in. And I took them out the next day. And I had extremely frizzy hair. But that was what you did back then. Because I had extremely straight hair. It's sort of gained curl and wave as it's as I've gotten older. That's the extent of it. Uh -huh. hmm. I'll change fountain pen today as well. Move my bin to up there because it was over there, and um, every time I wanted to open the drawers, I kept sending my bin flying. And of course, it was invariably full every time I did it, and it was just like, oh. La, la, la. She's so cute. It is Sunday. It's like ready tipping again. <laughs> so be warned if you stick a tip in in a Tomaway booklet, it's going to piss you off. Look at his eyelashes. He has amazing eyelashes. What does the heart emoji look like? That kiss kiss is a weird colour. I just had to put a little hearty face in. Alright, that's pretty much it, isn't it? I can't think of anything else. Um, yes, so I'm going to leave it there. I will get this uploaded. Um, I've already edited the first half, which means I won't be as long on the second half. <laughs> I don't always get a chance to do that. So, um, you know, when I do get to do it, it's like brilliant. Oh, God, look at what happened to my glasses. Look. The thingy that goes over my ear, I took them off and like the middle bit had just shattered and was stuck in my fucking hair and then the top bit shattered and it was just like oh so I just yeah 
It's actually not that uncomfortable, just wearing it without that, but I hope it doesn't irritate my ear, that's my only issue. <sighs> One of them days. Right. Um, you know what to do. Give this video a thumbs up. We like thumbs ups. Leave me a comment because Daryl likes comments. We love comments. Uh, if you hit the book, you'll be subscribed. And if you hit the bell, you know, YouTube willing, you'll be notified when I upload new content. And I will see you in Monday's edition of Today in My Bojo. Have a fantastic rest of your day. <laughs>